Welcome to Punky's World. We are going to make a way of the city and we're going to start it. Let's take the crop pot over here. Um, let me grab a liner for that. They look huge, don't they? But actually, they fit the top pot very well. It's a big top pot. So, go on in. Um, steps today. Yeah, that's perfect. I don't need to cut that at all. So. That's good. Um, show it to you. Right there. Now, let's get physical. Physical. <laughs> Not really. Um, this is mix this with water. Oh, that smells good. Pieces. There is no reason to. I'm gonna do just cut it in half and drop it in there. Okay, next. Okay, I need this. Potato. Okay. This is a nice sharp knife, which is good. It makes things easier. I'm going to use it to feel speed too. Um, it is recommended when dealing with a beet 
that you wear gloves because it's going to be very difficult to get the beaches stains off your hands. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go grab a pair of gloves. Before I deal with beets. Before I cut the potato any further, I'm going to clean it up. Put that on nice and clean. And then we're just going to cut the potato in darts. That's it. Now, before I do the beat, the rough beat, I'm going to. Oh, it would help if I actually plug in the TV itself. There we go. Um, I didn't plug it in. I didn't plug the TV in. I plugged everything into the TV, but didn't plug the TV in. My living room, so. That would have been funny if I tried to turn it on. Okay. Gloves will keep the beats from staying in time. Can't say as much about your clothes, but. The bead is going to stain the, the liquid that's in with the. Uh, uh, yuck. That's in with the um, ribs. Okay, there we go. Now all I have to do is first of all throw these away so they don't stain the countertop. Gotta keep the feet on the okay. Oh. Ah. Oh great, now it's a sword in the stone. Sort of stone, and I can't get it out. Ah, there we go. Okay, I need a lot of knives. Don't worry, I don't like it. Beat yourself to myself. Okay, you know what? Your knife for this. Um, 
little scraper right here. Oh, that smells good. I smell roasted onion in this. No. Maybe a little pork. Anyway, let's pour this in here. And uh, get some more water in the brush that smells so good. Actually, I should put brush in here. No. I'm not going to go in the water. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is just grab some fresh herbs. So I'm just going to grab the Italian and parsley. I'm going to put some basil. Here. Just basil. relatively sweet. Slide it back down the middle. I don't want too many. I don't want too much of this. Oh, 
Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Alright, I'm gonna put this on the crock pot. Smells good. So, uh, thank you for joining me. I will. Um, yum. I can't remember if I showed you this when I showed you everything from the... I think I did. Oh my goodness. Oh. God bless you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Um, it is a beautiful sunny day. It's a little breezy, a little cool, but not bad. Still in the 50s, so we'll take it. Um, oh my goodness. We did it, guys. Four hours would be 5.30. So, I will let you know tomorrow how that tasted. Please subscribe if you're new. And check out my other channel, Kid Missing. Uh, if you like true crime. And I will see you later. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.